basically wanted to tear the showroom apart, not literally, but uh, aesthetically and get a, a really good uh, lifestyle showroom effect. It was uh, out of January this year, we, we, we took three or four days, complete recreation of the display and, and to get it right was probably a, a whole day just in positioning vehicles uh, to get it somewhere near, but I think we'll be tweaking it all throughout the season depending on the stock levels. But we'll definitely have dedicated areas for each uh, brand. You know, it'll highlight how we, we, we present the vehicles to people. They love to see the, uh, the true colour of the upholsteries and the carpets and the, the, the way the light falls in the vehicle. And then they can imagine themselves living in the vehicle on site then, uh, whether it's dusk or morning. Uh, we're trying to arrange the vehicle so you can open garage doors, show awnings, show bike racks, uh, and, and just all the external access lockers that are day-to-day -day features that need to be used. I think we've put an emphasis on the higher price point vehicles and, and we've located them depending on the size of the vehicle as to where the sun rises and, and lowers so there's maximum light across all the vehicles on display. You, you, you wonder whether a lighter floor will be less practical or more practical but in reality it's, it, it far exceeds our thoughts and, and the whole showroom feels it's like working somewhere different now, I think, you know, and the customers have commented, you know, along the same lines. Uh, I think uh, that the way the, the vehicle looks is, is key, uh, whether, it, whether it's cleanliness, how it smells, anything like that, it's, it's, it's absolutely fundamental to the sale. We know, we know what customers expect and it's trying to, to meet those expectations, I think, really. Often people have an idea of what they want, but, but quite regularly or as, as often they end up with something quite different. But uh, once they've been thoroughly shown the, the advantages of different, different layouts and different features on a van, then, they can, then the decision is, is, is easily made then. When you are spending a lot of money on a vehicle, you want to be wowed by something and that is what we want to do um, but not just a skin deep wow you, you know it's functionality uh, build quality uh, features in the vehicle more than just cosmetic but you know true build quality and true uh, real life uh, usability but when people come here they can experience anything from a large liner of nine meters maybe uh, or right down the scale to a small van conversion at five and a half meters so they can get up on the bed in, a, in an elevating roof in a van conversion or try a, a luxury fixed island bed in, a, in an A-class van so you know they can, they can really saturate themselves in, in anything they fancy.